Hey, this is Jim at Broadfield. Well, thank you for joining us for another Broadfield Liquid Lunch and Learn every Thursday at 1 p.m. Eastern Time. You will see in the corner of my screen here that we have a special guest getting ready for our show today. This is James from Red. Hey, James, how are you, sir? Doing great, Jim. How about yourself? Doing excellent, man. Before we go into the formal introductions and the great show that we have for all of our Red dealers today, we'd like to start it off with a little bit of a liquid lunch. So I have a craft brew right here from Long Island, uh, Barrier Sweet. This is a double IPA with four different varieties of hops. Uh, nice and thick, citrusy flavor. That's really good. James, I know you're on the West Coast. It's a little early for you. Did you bring something to join us with today? I'm drinking just a nice coffee at the moment. I, I usually wait till the double digits before I enjoy the adult brews. Very nice, very nice. Now, do you brew your own iced coffee or did you make a trip out? Uh, you know what, I, I'm doing social distance, so I actually had it delivered. Oh, excellent, very good. That's, mm -hmm. the, that's one of the great things that, you know, if, if you're gonna put lipstick on the pig, the mm -hmm. fact that you can get everything delivered to your door right now is mm -hmm. something that I hope continues, mm -hmm. <laughs> you know? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I think that would explain why the DoorDash IPO went through the roof yesterday. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, yep. But I know our dealers, actually, it's funny, in talking to a lot of our dealers, we obviously have a lot of system integrators that do installs all over the country, and they're used to rolling out trucks and working with their customers on location. But now mm -hmm. we have other resellers who maybe aren't used to offering that level of service that mm -hmm. are now getting into that game as well. So mm -hmm. it's really kind of made the entire industry, across every industry, kind of rethink the way that they can do business and say, how can I better service my customers? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and, and, and that's what we've been doing with these virtual either liquid lunches or trainings or assisted calls. It's, it's a new way that we're doing business, staying engaged. Absolutely, and James, let's get right into it because what we're doing today is we are introducing the Red Komodo 6K to all of our red dealers. And, and, and I got it right there. Let's pull that up full screen because it really is a beautiful camera. Uh, this camera sets a price point and a capability that Red has not offered yet. And it really is a great opportunity for our dealers. And if you can see, I'm just doing a quick A and B. This is our current Komodo ST or our limited edition. This is the white one. It is no different than the black ones that you guys will be getting on delivery. And I'm holding up a DSMC2 body, and I know this is the gray one, but just imagine it's black. And look at the size difference. And also in my hand is about 3.4 pounds. This is 2.1 pounds, and this is ready to shoot right here. Once I add all these screens and the accessories, it's right around six pounds, and that's a shoot ready right there. That's awesome. I know you're really flipping that around with one hand with ease and uh, no problem whatsoever. Mm -hmm. James, before we get into it, why don't you give us a little introduction about who you are and what you do with Red? Yeah, I uh, thank you so much. I've been with Red for almost 10 years now. I am uh, not just a uh, salesman. I do shoot, and uh, I don't just sell the Kool-Aid. I drink it. I always say that jokingly. <laughs> I do own one of our helium cameras here, and much like I'm pointing right now at a camera, this is one of our DSMC2 Geminis, or my hand is being shot right here by one of our Monstro cameras. The fact that I can take a cinema grade camera and have no cables or rat's nest or accessories right here. I'm gonna switch it over to my desktop briefly here. And what you guys are gonna see, and I'm gonna try not to make anyone uh, sick here, is you should be seeing a live monitor out from that Komodo. And I'm not advocating selfieing or using <laughs> a, a Komodo for that. But notice I was just doing that handheld with this Komodo using the, ni the native wireless capabilities out. Now, not everyone's a vlogger, but maybe for uh, pre-visualization, social distancing, getting more people into the room or more hands on that camera while staying within protocol is uh, really great and advantageous. Uh, hey, you got some, some of the best webcams in the business, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, you know, and we talked about this a little bit earlier when we were preparing for the show. One of the mm -hmm. things that's great about that capability that you just showed off is when you have a creative professional invest in a camera like the Komodo, and now they have to go into live production, which really has happened across the entire industry, especially mm -hmm. over the last six to eight months. They mm -hmm. don't want to hook up a $99 webcam 
when they have mm -hmm. these professional tools in front of us. So mm -hmm. showing off that capability is especially relevant this day and age. Mm -hmm. and, and, and also, you know, I, I held up the, the DSMC2, but here's our Ranger camera system. Yep. And really, if the front of it looks similar, it's pretty much the same front profile, but just a fixed back. And whether it's the Ranger camera system, the DSMC2 camera system, or now this Komodo, you now have another tool to work with your customers and essentially, hey, we don't have to build that big seven pound camera and make it smaller. You now have a two pound camera to start from. So think of it as multiple brushes. Yep. You now have multiple camera bodies and your sensors, you can think of them as multiple digital film stocks. So if you really like that show on Netflix, Queen's Gambit, or uh, that show that you just saw a, a streaming TV show, we now have a sensor or a look option. And depending on your price point, we now have a camera body for you. And, and that's the great thing. And one of the things I always respected about Red is uh, you really approach the product design as creating the right tool for the job. And that brings us to the star of the show today, which is the Komodo, which I do want to let our dealers know is shipping now. Broadfield has allocations going out. If you're working with your customers, if you have orders with us, you can work with your Broadfield sales team and we can get these cameras out to you as they continue to roll off of the production lines. Uh, James and I, again, talked a lot this week as we were preparing for today's show and we're doing our best to prioritize those orders that are in hand to prioritize the customers who have been anxiously waiting on these and we're getting these cameras into their hands as quickly as possible. Without delivering uh, that point, James, let me take you on, let me have you take it over for a little bit and introduce yep. the Komodo and exactly what this exciting new camera is. Yeah. Thanks, Jim. And, and as I go ahead and take this over, I want to go ahead and let you know that this service, this offer, this one-on-one -on -one webinar that we're doing is definitely something that I encourage each and every one of you to utilize. Talk to your Broadfield rep and we can schedule and do this same kind of one-on-one -on -one virtual thing. And I can show you how we can get very much hands-on with Komodo or what I'm going to show you now with the presentation. So without further ado, let me go ahead and switch it up real quick. I'm going to show you guys a little presentation here. And this reel that I'm going to show you is all shot on Komodo. Now this is also lives on red.com as well as our dealer portal. So as I'm walking you through this video, know everything was shot on Komodo and everything I'm gonna be showing you is a great selling point or a great reason to go ahead and work with the system. Now I'm gonna turn the volume down a little bit there. And what you're seeing is essentially that four inch by four inch box, extremely small form factor, but look at these incredible images. The dynamic range to have 16 plus stops to get that talent, that athlete. And what you're seeing here is just look at that dynamic range. If you've ever worked with a red camera, ISO is never baked in. So that's what allows you to have that 16 plus stops to get that final look you want. James, if you can lower that music volume just a little bit more, I can hear you coming in, but you're being drowned out just a little bit. Jim, uh, the audio broke up just a smidge there. Could I, could I hear that comment one more time? Uh, you know what? You just lowered the music volume a little bit, and now I can yep. hear you much better. Okay. Well, I, I can promise you the song is very good. It's on our <laughs> YouTube page, and it's great for customers. But I think it's best to kind of hear the hook for the hat or the selling point that goes along with that. Sure. And what you're seeing right here, and I'll pause it, is the three flavors of red code that have been optimized for Komodo. Now, red has always had raw or our proprietary form of raw, but now you get to think of it as high quality, medium quality, or low quality, or studio, visual effects, Netflix, Hulu, Amazon, or you know what, anything for any of my customers that's gonna be online. The good news is all three of these are accepted, and as I push play, you're not really gonna see a visual difference. This is a visually lossless codec, and you're able to work with raw smaller than your ProRes. Now here you're going to see some examples of stabilization, both unstabilized on the left and then stabilized on the right. And no, the camera doesn't have in-camera stabilization, but what you're seeing here is great things like global shutter. And if I could pause it and go back, that is a true full exposure of your sensor. And you cannot do that with your other rolling camera system, rolling uh, shutter system. So notice we can work with strobes. 
That same global shutter is allowing us to do things that our customers do, like walk around handheld and maybe spin really quick. Now this is a no-no, but look at that straight tree, right? If that's a product or a, something we need to sell, each one of those helicopter blades are straight, and that's because of that global shutter. James, now, we don't quite... have the tree or the helicopter blade. Your video actually stopped on the okay. model in front of the window. Okay, I apologize there. Are you seeing the trees right now? No. Okay, well, you know what? Let's just go ahead and stop the share here. I want to take it back to my camera in full. And, and, you know, the great thing is we are talking to dealers today. They are familiar with the limitations of Zoom. <laughs> and all of the tools, like you mentioned in the start of this video, these videos are available on our Red's website. Uh, there's a Dropbox folder available to our dealers with lots of great marketing assets and tools to help close the sales. Uh, if you don't have access to that Dropbox, the boss is out of the office, you don't know where your login is, these videos are also posted up on YouTube, and you can share them with your customers at any time, absolutely. Mm -hmm. and, and I'm showing you guys right now the Dropbox currently. So these are the Perfect. videos, the logos, the images. Are you currently seeing that, Jim? I am, yes. Yep, and what we're talking about with the videos, I'm gonna come right here to Red's YouTube page, and if you haven't seen it yet, right, Jason Momoa, Aquaman talking about the Komodo all of these videos that we've been talking about these could be living on your site or shared with your customers and not to mention we also have our solitary series which are 13 complete episodes that are chapterized and there for both you and your customers and i would definitely encourage you all to take advantage of that because really now your sales reps are back on the phone helping assist your customers and getting them everything you need not spending hours and hours and hours trying to get that technical question answered and I have to tell you, that Solitary series is phenomenal. One of mm -hmm. my favorite tools that Red has put out, and Red puts out for great content. The mm -hmm. Solitary series, when you guys started doing that a few months ago, uh, mm -hmm. really just, it, it's, it's informative, it's easy to watch, it is definitely a valuable tool for both mm -hmm. our dealers and their customers who are gonna be using the cameras. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Great. Now, since the video didn't work, I'm going to go through a couple of slides here. And Jim, I want you to help me with any questions or anything that comes through. So I'm going to switch it back to my desktop. And you guys should see the uh, presentation here currently. And the question comes up with Komodo. Is it a camera? Is it a sensor? It's one and the same. It is this four inch by four inch by four inch box. It is that 2.1 pounds. And do notice that you aren't having to get a whole bunch of other additional red components to get up and ready. You're just going to be getting maybe your Canon BP batteries from Broadfield, your CFast cards from Broadfield as well, and you're going to be utilizing the EF to RF mount that comes standard on all these Komodos. But just notice that if you have any customers inquiring about RF mount support, that is something that is going to be enabled in the Q1 of next year. Great. Now, are you currently seeing three different configurations of the Komodo? whether that's the A camera with the very large airy zoom lens and some third-party accessories, maybe that Komodo in a technical application like a gimbal or a water housing here, or maybe coming out of a backpack. Are we seeing all three of those setups? We are, James. We're good. Yep. That flexibility allows this camera to sit right alongside the larger, more expensive DSMC2 and Ranger cameras, but getting all of that image quality, all of that form factor now at a much more accessible price point allowing us to have that very lightweight handheld rig that just has the SDI-based small HD monitor, maybe a CFast card in the side slot here. And now, because of that RF to EF adapter right out of the box, we're able to shoot that 6K cinematic quality shot all at a much more affordable price point. Now, some and of us have to- James, if yeah, I can interrupt you for a commercial message there, sure. because you mentioned the price point, uh, the sure. Komodo comes in at just under $6,000, $59.95 MSRP. We realize that we're talking to red dealers today who I am sure are already very familiar with the Komodo camera, but we wanted you to introduce some of these great features and the capabilities. But mm -hmm. at this price point, there are going to be other Broadfield dealers out there that can help expand this user mm -hmm. base. Uh, mm -hmm. We at Broadfield will work closely with all of our dealers to make sure that we get these cameras out into as many customers' hands across several different industries across the board. 
we mm -hmm. recognize that the traditional red dealer is going to service the cinematographers, the filmmakers, the guys mm -hmm. that are producing these Netflix shows and content. But mm -hmm. there's also other dealers that have direct relationships with maybe mm -hmm. a school film department or a documentary independent filmmaker that we can create these additional opportunities. And or House of Worship, advertisement agencies, right? Absolutely. There's so many other options other than just big cinema and, and we can have that same look. Yes, absolutely. And Broadfield is working closely with Red to make sure that we get these, this camera out in mm -hmm. a wide base out into the market. It, it really is that revolutionary in the sense that it opens mm -hmm. up all of these additional avenues for Red. And we're excited mm -hmm. about that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And, and, and it's some of just the key things. We don't even have to get too much into it. Like right now, just looking at my hands, you're probably seeing a little bit of a jello -y effect. That is completely negated with the global shutter that we're talking about with that Komodo camera. And also just looking at this shot right now, I'm pointing into a Gemini camera, and I know what some of you creatives are maybe thinking at home. Do we have to put him right in front of that window? You <laughs> still are getting all of that benefit of dynamic range, but with Komodo, you don't have the global shutter effect. So you're having a much more affordable camera here, giving you all of that dynamic range with a 12G SDI out. So for that broadcast, for that live record reason, you could actually shoot 6K in camera and get that 1080 4K UHD out without having that field of view crop in. So really great features for Komodo and also expanding it to the customer or dealer use case. Absolutely, and I know you have a lot more features and other stuff to talk about, so I will let you get back to your presentation. I did want to interrupt with that because of that's what we're excited about with this camera is all of mm -hmm. these additional avenues and stuff that are opened up. Mm -hmm. Well, and, and feel free to interrupt. I actually like the live interaction, and this sure. is what we encourage with our dealers within our webinars and with our customers. So uh, continue to keep me honest on timing. I've got a couple more key things to show you here. So sure. jumping, jumping back into it, you should be seeing uh, the PowerPoint here. And notice this is a, the Komodo. And once again, this is an orange one or a white one or a black one. That is just cosmetic. They are not doing any other frame rates or any other tech specs. These customers just paid more money for an alpha product and they bought it sight unseen. So just know your black ones are gonna perform the exact same. Now notice we have SDI monitors or EVFs here that all require power. The camera is a seven volt system here that requires seven volts in from the BP batteries. How do you power additional sources here? And that's where I point out, you're gonna use third party accessories and that's where all of that can be seen either through Broadfield or talk to us about other approved third-party power. Now here you're currently seeing Canon BP batteries, but notice the camera can accept up to 17 volts. So that's where the core system, the wooden plate, will allow you to use V-mount and gold-mount batteries and also allow for additional power to power third-party accessories. Really key feature here. Absolutely. Now, now, I want to jump in really quick and just show you guys this, because I think this is something that really tells a thousand words here. And what you're seeing is a representation of the rolling shutter on the left. Now, this progressive top to bottom scan is what allowed our sensor and other CMOS sensors to get that bright, bright and that dark, dark, or that 16 stops of dynamic range. Great for motion, but if you shot a still or if something was moving very fast, like a fight scene or an action scene, you had a warp and skew. Now a global shutter is what you're seeing here on the left, that true on and off of the shutter, but this lack of time when there was no light being super saturated meant you gave up on sensitivity. It worked with strobes, it had less skew, but you maybe only had nine or 10 stops when the previous camera had 14. Now here's a, this is as technical as we'll get guys, I promise. Here's a, here's a uh, dynamic range chart and most won't count this square and most don't count these over here but each of these are a stop of dynamic range. And this is where I'll say, yes, you could go with that other camera system, but you're not gonna have 16 stops of dynamic range. And it's really key here, cause I'll take it back to my camera in full because the Komodo is at 16 stops and that's on par with our other systems, which are much more, uh, much more of an investment here. And oftentimes when I talk about all of that color and science and dynamic range, you often wanna talk about data rates and so I'm gonna put this up here just to show you that the red ones, pun intended, are from red. And notice with Komodo, we now get to choose low quality, medium quality, and high quality. 
And yes, some of these other camera systems might be doing 6K or some form of RAW, but it's 12-bit or 10-bit. Definitely not 16-bit RAW. And I think we've all seen uh, what that looks like when you're looking at something that's not quite as much bit depth as 16-bit. And that's where 16-bit is 281 trillion possible colors. Wow. And this is, this is what allows us to essentially have that look, have that quality. And I'll end on this. You're looking at my little chameleon here, and we're not going to watch this. But I just wanted to show you side by side. This is less than a half hour. This is almost an hour of recording. Are you seeing a difference on your end? I am not. So if I just doubled your recording and you're not seeing a quality loss, guess which one we're using with your client next time? Oh, absolutely. <laughs> and if you want to do your 2K or 400% punch in, this is where yours usually cannot hide, right? High detail to low detail, darks to lights. This is where you would see blocking. And with red code, you're able to change that and have a workable raw file that oftentimes is smaller than the ProRes or the files that you're currently working with. So bit depth, flexibility, and now affordability, you're not having to make that compromise with maybe one of those other camera systems. It, absolutely, and, and that goes back to the red mantra uh, that we've been promoting ever since we came on board with you guys. And that's really the three R's, uh, the red code, the um, reliability, reliability, and, and resolution. resolution. You know, mm -hmm. I remember them. <laughs> I was going to help you out because sometimes it changes, but you know, that reliability, right? That can yep. be also reliability to work right now when maybe I'm right here and you can see me live. And then here's my camera over here yep. in COVID in 2020. I can notice that this one is maybe uh, notice not on the right uh, look or color grade. I'm going to use the app here off camera to turn on my 3D LUT. And notice that my camera just went to black and white. I can then even punch in on this camera so you can get a little bit closer view of this top LCD screen. And for that customer that absolutely needs autofocus, notice I'm going to change my autofocus using this app. And this is something that's completely free on Android, on iOS. And if you don't want to do all of this control on your phone, because maybe you don't want to give up your phone, you're going to see a quick transition here. And notice I'm showing you guys my desktop here. And this is the live monitor coming directly out of the camera. Oh, wow. And maybe, maybe that's a lot, and I don't want to do that, just that monitor out. I could come right over here and notice this is that same camera control, and I'm going to turn off that 3D LUT or change the focus on that lens. And once again, this is all using the native capabilities of this incredible camera system. And if you really want to learn how to harness this, don't worry, there's a solitary series right here on connecting the Komodo and getting started. And these are great half hour or hour watches to go ahead and set it up. And they're completely chapterized so your customer can learn exactly where to go and exactly how to set it up. That's awesome. James, one of the things I'm going to do for our dealers immediately when we're done today, uh, obviously mm -hmm. this webinar is going to live on our website as a resource. I'm going mm -hmm. to include a quick link directly to that solitary series, directly mm -hmm. to uh, the YouTube channel into all the great stuff that Red offers. I will mm -hmm. still have the Dropbox folder. Any dealers mm -hmm. out there who don't have access to the Dropbox, don't remember what your password is, you can reach out to me directly, jim at broadfield.com. I can help you get set up and running with that. Mm -hmm. James, thank you so much for walking through the Komodo 6K today. We are super excited about this camera. Yeah, and, 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 and just know with stock and demo cameras being very hard to get to, I can tell you that when most of our calls or Zoom calls, utilize myself. See how this says Komodo training at the bottom. I can work with yourself and Broadfield, and we can make that have your dealer logo at the bottom. And this is your lead, and I'm just an extension of your team, and I'm going to help you close that deal. And absolutely. And that's really where we're most successful. Our dealers know, uh, our tagline for our company is people like doing business with Broadfield because we make it easy to do business. Mm -hmm. When we have a resource, at the yeah. manufacturer like yourself who is mm -hmm. also available to our dealers as an extension mm -hmm. of their team it mm -hmm. becomes a phenomenal relationship that really mm -hmm. leads to the most success so james mm -hmm. i'm going to thank you in advance for offering that service and for mm -hmm. your time in doing these trainings with our dealers and their mm -hmm. opportunities yeah and, and i'll show you just real quick on how easy it is to schedule this is essentially the interface we spend half of our time. Does this time work for you? Does this time work for me? 
I now can send you guys a link, you provide it to your customer, they provide their time slot, their information, and I'm gonna make sure that you get that same calendar in invite, and look, it's got your look and feel to it, and this is something that uh, really just making that ease of scheduling and that ease of working with your customer that much, uh, that much more efficient for you. It, that's awesome. In, in James's presentation, he was talking about the third-party accessories. Broadfield obviously is your source for the red Komodo 6K, as well as all the red accessories to go with it. But we're also your source for the third-party accessories. We have all of the red certified accessories, including the Angelbird, CFAST 2 storage cards and readers, the ProGrade CF storage cards and readers, the small HD monitors, which give you that red Komodo camera control capability on the small HD monitors themselves. And we even have the Lacy One Big Pro SS One Big Dock SSD Pro. Say that ten times fast. Uh, storage <laughs> drives, which have a CFast 2.0 reader built into it. So when you're talking to your customers about the entire Red workflow, we can help you set up the entire production workflow from camera to ingest to post and everything in between. Uh, our Broadfield sales team is fully trained on all of these products and how they work together. We also have Pete Snyder as part of our team who worked in the New York store for Red for quite some time and is an invaluable resource in setting up the Komodo and all of this great stuff together. And of course, as we already mentioned, we have James at our disposal who can definitely help us with your customers get everything set up and operate mm -hmm. in the right way. And then I also want to mention the GDU accessories. We have the full product line, which can really take that red Komodo and make it look super cool with some of their Derringer handles and Timmy Ridge and other stuff like that. James, thank you so much for joining us today. No problem, guys. So if you have any questions about the red Komodo, you can reach out to your Broadfield salesperson or me, Jim at Broadfield.com. We also have a great show scheduled next week where we are going to have Scott Sheehan from LiveView joining us to talk about the LiveView Solo, the updated modems that they're offering as part of the Solo Connect, and the great holiday special that they have available now through the end of the year. That will be our last show for the 2020 calendar year. We will be taking some time off for the holidays with our families, but we'll be back in January with an even better schedule. So join Broadfield every Thursday at 1 p.m., grab a drink, and learn about the great new products and technologies available. Until next week, cheers. Broadfield Distributing is a value-added distributor of live production, streaming, video editing, and storage products. We only sell to resellers. We are always looking for new dealers. So call us at 1-800-634-5178 or email sales at broadfield.com. You'll like doing business with Broadfield because we make it easy to do business.